Hey everyone, welcome back to another Momentum Monday. My name is Mac and I am here today to talk about how to set up and index your Squarespace website using Google Search Console. Uh, doing so enables Google to scan, crawl, and index your website so that people can find you if they're looking for your products or services or if they're just searching your brand name. I'm gonna go through eight different steps of how you can use Squarespace with Google Search Console to submit it and index it so that people can find you and you can rank higher on Google. Thanks for watching. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Also, turn on the post notifications, uh, whether you're on YouTube, Facebook, or Instagram. Uh, we're always dropping knowledge on small business marketing. Uh, here at Momentum, we do a lot with digital marketing, SEO, PPC, social media, and so on. Uh, so let's jump into how to set up and index your Squarespace website using Google Search Console. All right. All right, first things first. Now, what we need is to create a Squarespace account. If you already have this, I'm assuming you do, otherwise you probably won't be watching this video. Make sure you're updated to the premium account and you activated your domain already. Uh, for this example, we'll just use one of my friends' website, which is virussafepro.com. Uh, here you can see that this uh, domain is live. It is set up and activated. And you can do that using a premium account with Squarespace. Um, and as you can see here, this the settings the back end where you can set up and activate the domain. You can get a domain from them. Uh, you can use a domain that you own and so on and so forth. So now that we're in here, let's talk about next steps. What we want to do is also make sure that we have a Google account. So you can go to gmail.com and create an account or get a Google business uh, premium account and set up a professional account with Google. So do one of those two things. Gmail is always free, so I prefer that. And once you set up that Google account, uh, then you need to set up a Google Search Console account, which is easy as going to Google Search Console and using the Gmail or Google account you just created, uh, you wanna log in and then hit Start Now. And then from here, you're gonna see uh, sort of the uh, settings within the back end of Google Search Console. All right, here within Google Search Console, you see overview, you can see the different domains you have in here. Uh, sitemaps is important, we'll talk about that. Links, settings, so on and so forth. If you go down to settings, uh, you know, you can see ownership, you can invite other people and change the address. So now that you logged in and set up Google Search Console, uh, log back into Squarespace. So log into your Squarespace account, just hit log in, use whatever login you have. And before we set up and connect the two accounts, make sure you remove your site-wide password. Don't have any password protections to log into the account. That'll interrupt the connection. If you have a third-party domain, ensure it's connected properly. There's a link here for support. Uh, and then that might take 72 hours. And then you wanna verify with Google Search Console, it won't work if there's any trial sites that are hidden. So make sure the site is published and live using your domain. And then a Google account is required, like I mentioned, so you can create a free one with Gmail or get a professional one as well. All right, next, we wanna to go to the home menu and then click analytics. So once you're in your website, go to, and we'll go over here, go to analytics, and then you're gonna see search keywords. This will give you some uh, general overviews of this page. Uh, go to search keywords. And then it says Google search keywords, verify your site with Google search console, connect. So hit connect. And since you've already created that Google account, you can just choose that integration, uh, choose that, click the account, log in if you have to, then hit allow or approve. And then this is going to merge the two accounts. I keep getting a thousand messages, my apologies. Um, while that is working, you wanna go over here. I believe that went through. So you can pull back over here. It says you're connected. Your site is now connected to a search console. It could take up to 72 hours. So keep that in mind. Um, and then you want to connect it to Google search console following that uh, the way that I just showed you. Next, you want to index your website. So you want to submit a sitemap within Google search console. A sitemap is like a XML or data sheet that basically shows all the pages to Google within search console. So to do that, you go to Google Search Console, make sure you're logged in. And then it tells you here with Squarespace, all you need to do is add the sitemap URL. Back 
that is submitted. We'll come back and check within uh, 24 hours, see if there's any issues there. Uh, that is the process. Uh, it says there's no issues detected. So if you have any questions, comment below if you like this video. Make sure you hit that like, hit that subscribe button. Please share this with friends, anybody who's interested. Uh, a couple warnings and errors, uh, errors here. When verifying with Google Search Console, uh, it can do uh, restrictions with robots.txt, so make sure to look that up. It's completely normal though. Uh, to learn more about other errors, uh, click this link in the blog. And then just make sure you check back within 72 hours. And like I said, if you need help with this, comment below, send me an email, mac at needmomentum.com. Check out our website. Uh, hopefully we can help you with anything digital marketing related. And uh, I appreciate your time. Happy Monday, and uh, we'll see you next time.